Aloha. You can call me Craw. Today we are continuing to play Portal 2. Uh, I started playing Portal 2 last Sunday night. Yeah, let me close the door real quick. Yeah, last Tuesday, Sunday night, I played Portal 2. Um, it's a good game. It's a good game so far. I have some experience with Portal, not as much as many other people. I played the original Portal on my Xbox 360. I played Portal 2, the LEGO Dimensions expansion pack. And that's really all I've done. Um, it's been good. It's been good so far. I've enjoyed it. It's not the game that I thought it was going to be. Because, again, I mean... My first experience with Portal 2 was with LEGO Dimensions. So I foolishly thought, hey, this is going to be a lot like it. And I enjoyed it, so why wouldn't I want it to be like it? Um, so. Yeah. There's that. Um, but yeah, it, it's been a good game. It's been a good game. I've been happy with what I've done so far. I've been happy with the puzzles so far. I've played a couple of games since Portal 2 that have been in this puzzler genre. I played um, The Turing Test, which I didn't think would be a puzzler game, but ended up being a lot like Portal 2 in terms of concept, in terms of how the game was played, the mechanics, and all that stuff. And I was a little disappointed with it, but hey, I think a lot of people were disappointed with it. But it was free because I got it on the Game Pass, so there's nothing wrong with that. This game wasn't I got it on sale on Steam, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy with the price. I'm not complaining about the price at all. I feel like it's been worth it. Um, yeah, so we've done about 2.3 hours into it. I feel like we're cruising along. I have no idea how deep into the game we are, but it's been fun so far. I'm, I'm happy with what we've done. So let's get going. Let's continue to play. Feel free to ask any questions, have some fun, and most importantly, aloha. Aloha, Nisha and Misha. Nisha Mashmika. Am I saying that wrong? Nisha Mashemcha. I'm really butchering your name right now, and I apologize. But aloha, good to see you, my friend. Welcome to my chat. This is the first time I've really been playing a game that I've had you here, so I'm very excited about that. Um, Sunday nights, we generally do puzzle games, and so we're playing Portal 2 tonight. Have you any experience with Portal 2? I just realized my headphones aren't working. Um, let's go to headphones there. Nisha. Nisha. Excellent. That was quick. I didn't expect to die that quickly. So how are you doing today, Nisha? I'm trying to remember what I did to get into this spot. Alright, so I have two. Okay, they can't shoot me through that. That's always a positive sign. How are you doing? Are you having yourself a good weekend? Oh, that's interesting. That's not such a good idea. That was not a good idea. <laughs> Sheesh. I'm just getting slaughtered right now, left and right. Okay, let's go over to... There. That wasn't good. Yeah, 
I don't really know where I'm supposed to be going right now. Okay, and now let us see that needs to be a yellow. So that will get me over there. Let's go. Yep. Not a good idea. Not a good idea. Do you have any experience with uh, Portal 2 Nietzsche? I have no idea what those things do there. There. Okay, that's nice. Let's see what this does. Okay, so that doesn't do me a whole, whole lick of a good there. I really don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. This just drops that. And then it pops that down. Okay. Nothing I can put onto that. There's no jump or push or anything there. That was not a good move. Okay. It's always good when you come across one of these puzzles and you're not quite sure what to do. Oh, I'm. This is nice and convenient. I have no idea what those do. There. 
Okay, what does this do? But how do I get this to turn? I switched to my computer. Are you in story mode? Yes, I'm in story mode. This is my first time doing a playthrough of this. So try and figure out what this does. Does this move or push anything? I don't think I can do anything with this. Can I give a hint? Sure, why not? I've gotten over to that side all the way over there. Have you heard of the concept of bending light with mirrors? Is that what those are? Are those mirrors? But how do I get it to go through that? So that's what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to use those... Good luck. Yes, good luck. Because I'm looking, because I don't have any place where I can shoot that through, because those are all black walls. The other thing I have that's a laser is this thing. Which, again, this doesn't... Like, that doesn't do me a whole lot of good there. I look at it in steps. Yeah, I'm figuring that. There's got to be steps to it. What do you have to work with? I've got my gun. <laughs> I've got my gun. I've got this. I've got that guy. I've got this over here. I've got, oh, my bad. If I shoot that hole through there, I can get over here. And then that will give me access to this and this. That will just drop those down and they will bounce over there into the water. But I have no way to catch those is I don't have any white bars. Those prisms would be nice. I think that's where I'm being thrown off with because I'm looking at where I can put portal walls. That, and I think that's the thing I'm being thrown by. I'm looking at where I have portal walls because like if I can get one of those two, I could then bounce that laser through these prisms to get to that. And that's the key, is I gotta get one of those boxes that falls and goes somewhere else. But how do I get that? <gasps> I know how to get one at least. Right? In theory, right, this is going to bounce it if I get, I got to get the right angle though. All right, so let's go back to that because I need to do it from over here. All right, so let's get our shot on. Okay. Boom, right? I'm on the right ways, right? Was your first threat? You're looking too closely. No, no, this will work. Watch, watch. Boom. Right? Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. I don't worry about threats. 
All right, so now I have that. Okay, let's see. I need to get... Thank you. I have no idea where you just went. Bum 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 Not what I wanted to do. Okay. Look, if I can get a second one of those. Try taking the turret. Yeah, no, I'm trying to get the turret. I'm trying to get the turret. And now that I've got this. I needed to get both of these boxes. And now I can come over here. I feel awful about that surprise. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. Parents who are trying to reach do not love you. Please hang up. Oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. So, yeah. So, the problem was I couldn't figure out how to get those two prisms. That was the thing I couldn't get past my head. But thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you for the advice. Um... What don't I have? Oh, I gotta angle that one better. Hold on. Get that angle going. No problem. Yeah, no, 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 thank you, thank you for the advice. I just couldn't figure out, and that happens sometimes when you're just like, There, perfect. By the way, I know I'm playing on a on a PC, but I just I have to have my controller. I am the worst with using a keyboard. I can type. I can legitimately type. I just struggle with the keyboard. I'm sitting here going like, "Where's the Q? Where's the Q? My fingers on W. What's next to W? Where's the Q?" I keep going back here because I'm so used to playing games like Tomb Raider. I expect there to be like a health pack or something back here, and there never is. One of these days I'll figure it out. Yeah. Yeah, I struggle. I struggle very much when it comes to. Oh. I talk my way onto the old Nanobot work crew rebuilding this shop. They are really I know, Jerry. No, I'm on a break, mate. I'm on a break. Ah! Just hang in there for five more... What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Only five more chambers? I feel like this is too short if there's only five more chambers. They don't want you to live. No, they don't want me to live. I feel like five more chambers is not enough. I feel like this game needs at least a hundred chambers. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. <laughs> and you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. Yes, it actually is pretty funny. 
I always say, um, and this is actually a Mel Brooks quote. I don't know if you're a big fan of Mel Brooks, but um, uh, a man walks into an open sewer and dies. That's comedy. I stub my toe. It's a tragedy. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a prism. We got a laser. We got a second prism. We got a couple of those bad mother... All right, first here. I got some mirrors that needs to go through. I have some stuff up there. You hate this room. This one took you forever. Five ever. It's so long, it's not even forever. Okay, let's figure it out. Let's walk through the problem. I mean, luckily, I don't think I need to do anything until I can get up to that. Let's just see what's in this. There's nothing up here. So I need a prism up here, so. Now, I can't use this to angle the prism down, so it is really that. How do I get up there? There. No? Are you kidding me? That is not a shootable wall. Of course it's not a shootable wall. That would only be... I have that. And I can throw something across that. Let's just go get this one. Cause that's gonna need to go over there to two to hit me to three. Okay. But I need some way to get up to that. And that does not appear to be a wall that I can shoot anything onto. So far I have that jump, and that's all I really have, but I don't think I can jump and turn. Oh, I know what I gotta do. Alright, and then when I go through, I need to get that jumping high enough to shoot that, and that's gotta be a blue. Which is, of course, let me just confirm, blue is my right trigger. But how am I going to be able to shoot that? While I'm holding. That's the question I have to solve. All right, let's just jump through it and make sure that my jump is right. All right, so if I could have made that jump, with it, that would have worked. Oh, here's an idea. Can't believe I didn't think of that. Alright. I'm just 
just gonna trust I made that shot. Similarly, we're going to need to jump through that. Nope, that did not work. All right, we're just going to need to shoot it lower. So let's try to go to about... Nope. I mean, I feel like I'm doing the right thing. I just didn't angle it right. Nope. Not high enough, but the right angle at least. Yeah, this room doesn't look like it's a hard room. It just looks like it's a... Gain the right angles. There, 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 there. What? Because that wasn't high enough, I guess. It doesn't look like it's a hard to figure out. It's just a hard to accomplish room. A little higher, yeah. A little higher. What, Sam? I have my son, Sam. Sam, can you say aloha to Nisha? Aloha, Nisha. 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 Yeah, you don't know. You don't need any drink my drink. Actually, I was coming in here to just let you know that, uh, um, you know the, uh, what's your, do you have um, a calculator in here? No, I don't. Close the door. All right. Yeah, no, my, my kids are adorable sometimes. Sometimes. His, like, dream is to be... It's just a matter of, again, doing that last one and flinging myself across that this time. Such a dad. Yeah, no, I mean... And I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Yeah, what is it? Oh, you're not going to tell me. Yeah, no, I mean, I enjoy being a dad. It really is fun. Um, my kids definitely, especially this one, so that was Sam. He's my older of the two. Um, I mostly stream because he thinks it's amazing, right? Like, other people watch me. I get that. But it, it's just really... It's, he thinks it's amazing, and there, when I have a stream where I get like no one watching me, and I spend like two hours doing nothing, um, like that helps get me motivated to keep doing it. And it's something that I know he really wants to do when he gets older. Um, Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. <laughs> That's right. The facility is completely operational again. Um. And I know that with all the kids growing up these days, they're all growing up wanting to do these type of things. They're all growing up being a part of an online community, right? Um, like I was talking with some dads today, and or actually yesterday, 
and I was just talking about, and all the dads in town know that I'm like into this stuff. Um, and he, and he found out his son played Among Us. He had no clue that his kid was playing Among Us. All right, so I got a ton of these, and I need to get them to go through to that. And it looks like I need them to be doing it at all times. All right. All right, so let us. I just need to make sure that this works. All right, well, that was one. That's not the one I was hoping it would work. Perfect, okay. Um, Dad, why is it? What? Um, I forgot to say something last time. Um, so, the thing I wanted to say is, um, you know, like, uh, you know, like the, uh, arcade level, you know the arcade and moving out? Yes, I knew the arcade and moving out. Um, those are actually, like, levels, like, speed, like, like, there's, a there are actually, like, levels, like, Holly's Home. Yeah? There are actually, actually levels, like, stuff like Holly's Home. And they're one of those. Okay. I just wanted to tell you that, and the other thing was, why isn't, why isn't, why isn't stream element still supposed, name supposed to be a little hot about? Oh, that's not, that's interesting, good call. Let's double check. That's awesome. Let's see. Um, pause it real quick. Let's go look. Let's go look. Manisha, I don't, hope you don't mind us taking a real quick break to make sure our bot is set up properly. And Tam, can you not lean on me every second of every day? Well, well, you should be grateful that I'm drinking water, not your soda. I am very grateful that you're drinking um, the wrong one. Take your time. Stream element. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Modules. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, chat commands. User management? Yeah, no, no. Um, how do I get it to do a custom bot name? I'd set this up before and now it's not working. Um, hold on, Sam, you're really leaning on me right now. Stream elements, custom bot name. Yep. All right. Nope, 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 nope. That's not that. Uh, nope. Oh, wait, no. It's over here, Clay. Sam, I, I'm not worrying about this right now. I want to play a game. 
I want to play a game. Thank you. I feel like this is a rabbit hole that we will go down, Nisha, and I'd rather play Portal right now. <laughs> I don't think my bot name being Stream Elements is detracting from the game. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. So those two I can shoot through portals. And if I take this out, it's gonna shoot to that wall. So this is the one I have to use two, right? That one has to be used with the two prisms. This, on the other hand, let's just get rid of him. Alright. Oh, wait a minute. I can't redirect it two ways. That would be huge if I could redirect that two ways. Right, it only can redirect one way. can't cause it collects light rather than laser presses. Does it? You can't because it collects the light rather than laser passing through. There's a way to get them all to pass through. So this one has to be here. Because this laser can't do anything except go through this. Oh, um, uh, shoot. All right, let's see. So that was there. <laughs> Jeez. Nisha, what would I do without you? I think these test chambers look even better than they did. He before. can be taught. <laughs> you just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Exactly. You know what I mean? Okay, so I played um, the Turing test. And every time I solved one of the puzzles in the Turing test that was tough, I felt like that was the dumbest fucking idea. Every one of those, these type of challenges, I feel like that's a creative way to do that. I don't know if that's an accurate statement or not. surprise for you after this next test. Not a fake, tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise. Speaking of not being... Tragic consequences. And real confetti this time. The good stuff. Our last bag. Part of me is going to miss it. But at the end of the day, it was just taking up space. 
but can I think laterally if I really am still every time hoping that there's something behind that elevator? All right, that's gonna go through something. Let's start with the obvious. What did that do? All right, that gave me a helper cube. What's going on? Who turned off the lights? Hey, buddy, I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. I know I'm early, but we have to go right now. Walk casually toward my position, and we'll go shut her down. Look, metal ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! <laughs> Yeah, I am having fun. Don't worry about the future plans that I've got in store. We're going to shut down the turret production line, or I turn off our neurotoxin and then confront it. Again, though, for the moment, run! Run, oh, you can The irony is you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend came up with. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh look, there's a deer. You probably can't see it. Get closer. I had to try. I had to try. Is this really close to the end? So I'm going to have to shoot the gun at something else before they close those doors. Come on, come on. I know, I'm dying a lot. My best not to die right now. This is the end, I'm gonna be so bummed. Like, I'm, oh, I'm an hour into this stream, 45 minutes. 
I could have just stayed up later last Monday night. Knock this one out of the park. I really hope this isn't the end. What's the matter? Can you fix it after stream? Oh, be fixed very quickly. Let me. Not to be spoiled, but you've got at least another five hours. Yes. Where are you from, by the way? Where are you from? I just got to know where you're from, Nisha. Chapter five, the escape. USA. Oh, okay. All right. Let's see. We're gonna. I'm glad to know I still got another five hours of this. Well done. Okay, follow me. We've still got work to do. At least she can't touch us back here. What's happening? Um, hmm. Okay. Okay, d uh, don't move. Oh, I'm in Western Mass. Okay, all right. So, I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here we go. Ah! Oh, for God's sake. They told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I mean, I, I don't even know why they bothered giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless. Man. Ooh. It's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the original. No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal. Let's keep moving. The factory entrance must be around here somewhere. Careful, careful. Wait, careful. Let oh. me light this jump for you. Yeah, so we're out in Western Mass, which is the northeast this as well. Dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, I gotta jump on that, okay. Oh, nicely done. Thank you. Quick, this way. Here's an interesting story, you might like this. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing, but uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself. Nepotism ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. That the um, sorry, that's uh, no, it's like smelly. Just just tending to the humans. Sorry about that. That just that just slipped out. I'm a bit insensitive. Um, the smelly humans. All right. Yeah, that's a good can idea. That wall back there? Of course I can. Okay, there's another wall over here. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the way they look. And there. Yes, the way the way we look, yes. Let's go down, okay. Yeah. 
It was funny because this is um. I played the uh, Lego Dimensions version of this. Huh? Oh, you need my iPad? Sure. There you go. That's my daughter. Holy Toledo, welcome to the stream, Para. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Something tells me I need to now hop on this. And work my way down. You can tell I'm concentrating because I'm really sticking my tongue out. And run. Yeah, my daughter is a sweetheart when she wants something. There are many times she is not a sweetheart. Many times. One of my favorite stories to tell about her, she's like maybe 18 months old. And she wanted me to read a book and I was being... Slow and steady stays alive. Uh, being a sweetheart reminds you of someone who does being a sweetheart remind you of. Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. All right. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line. Oh, she reminds me of someone who says aloha, yes. So this actually reminds me of, this actually reminds me a lot of the Lego Dimensions level this part right here um, so yeah so she's like 18 months old and she um, she wanted me to read a book to her and I was ignoring her I was being a terrible dad at the moment um, turret redemption lines are not rides please exit the turret redemption line And um, I was ignoring her, right? You know, and so she hits me in the face with the book. And then I'm crying and I'm mad because she like almost split my lip. And then she like comforts me. She gets up in my face. She's like, oh, I'm so sorry, dad. Da, 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 da. And then after I'm calmed down, she, she, you know, she's kissed me and all that stuff. She goes, book. <laughs> like, I split your lip once, old man. I will do it again. All right. Something tells me this is not a game where I'm gonna take a wrong path. I may have just, you know you'd think that. And of course I probably have now walked into a wrong path. Except Shoot. Oh no, I'm one of the bad ones, aren't Uh oh. Maybe there's a wrong way to go. <laughs> It just doesn't seem to me like a game that would let you go down the wrong path. Alright, we're gonna go the other way now this time, just to see what happens. Yeah, see? There's nothing down here. Nothing down here. I have to go that way.
Did you play? Yes, I played the first portal, and I played the Lego Dimensions portal. So I played the first portal, and I played the Lego Dimensions portal, and that's all I've played. Dimensions one. Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. Well. Response. Yeah. See that scanner right there. Right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which template. to toss, and it's using Response. that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, it will shut down the whole production line. Right. Um. Hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door template. so that we can get at it. Response. Technical. Um. You'll need to turn around while I do this. Done. Um. Okay, go on, just pull that turret out. to stop this turret line. Have you got any ideas? Uh, any ideas? Any ideas? No? No, I mean, you know. Are you, are you still thinking, or what's happening? Yeah, no, that's, that was my idea, dude. Here's a plan. Let's just both Response. continue yeah, yeah, yeah. contemplating the in absolute silence. Template. Response. Alright. So I can hop through into here. Response. Nothing is over in here. Response. Really, I need to get you in there. Oh, wait! Ah, oh, no, 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 I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. No, I haven't got it. Pew, pew, I'm a bad turret. Oh, come on, you guys! Response. Oh, I just had one idea, which is that I could pretend to her that I've captured you, Response. and give you over, and she'll kill you, but then I could go on living. So, what's your view on that? Response. Yeah, because I can't go back out. Can I go back out over here? There's no turret in it. Maybe the system. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, have you got an idea? Template. Okay, well, all right. Response. So just do your idea and then come straight back. Template. Response. Template. Response. Sorry, what's going on over there? You know, I'm actually over here still thinking Template. really hard. I can't go out that way. Template. Response. Oh, let's let it get a bad template. Template. Response. Boom. There that goes. Response. Yeah, that makes sense. So again, I mean, it was one of those things, right? You know, I couldn't figure that one out. Thank you very much for the help. Oh, brilliant! It's that's brilliant. New template. Excellent. If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. Classic. 
Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm going to go and hack the door open. Response. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. Response. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Keep Response. one eye on the door. This door is actually pretty complicated. No. Oh. I launched the door being open. Response. I mean, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like a hacker alert? Sorry, yeah, you. Enough, oh, no, no, no. But just in, it's just mentioned in the future. Coffee. I appreciated the help. I appreciated it. Use turrets. So let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. Bring your daughter to work day. Aww. That did not end well. <laughs> and... 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, you know, low hanging fruit and all that. It so, really is. Look at that, it's growing right up into the ceiling. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? At least you won't starve, though. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. Wait, look at those carefully. Okay. Stop. Baking soda volcano. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research. Even Who does the, the big tater belong I'm to? I'm guessing this wasn't one of the scientists' children. You know, I don't want to be snobby, but let's be honest, it's got it's got manual labourer written all over it, hasn't it? I'm not saying they're not as good as the professionals, you know, they're just they're just a lot dumber. Energy hypothesis. I don't see a name on this. I don't know who the big tater belongs to. But this is the big potato I'm assuming. And it goes right up into the ceiling. It's you, Shell. That's me? I'm the one who made this? I don't see Shell's name on this, though. Oh, well. That's pretty cool. So I was a daughter of someone who worked there. It's there. Where there? Oh, there. There in the bottom right hand corner. I see it. I see it. Cool. Nice Easter egg hunt. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for pointing that out to me. Alright. Let's get back on with the game. The problem is the problem. Yeah, no. Absolutely guaranteeing you 100% that it's this way. No, it's not this way. <laughs> okay, let's try this way. I don't like this room already. Yeah, what I liked about the Lego Dimensions one is it ends with you like on this planet up, up above. You like actually get to see like a little farm and stuff. So I'm anticipating this to end similarly to that. Ha! I knew we were going the right way. This is the neurotoxin generator. Bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not gonna be able to just, you know, push it over. Have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top, so uh, let's go and investigate. Oh. 
door's locked. Just checked it. No way to... What are you doing? We don't know what that button... Oh, well done. Let's see what's in there. Good news. I can use this equipment to shut down the neurotoxin system. It is, however, past the... Ah, alarm bells. No, don't worry. All right. Not a problem for me. You may as well have a little rest, actually, while I work on it. Alright, that won't take me back down. We got some electronics in there. A monitor. Yes. Do you smell the neurotoxin? Hold on, the neurotoxin levels are going down. Hold on, something's wrong. Neurotoxin levels up to 50%. No, it's dang. Sorry, my mistake. I meant to say it's dang 50%. It's good news. Carry on. It's still going down. It's still going to keep it up. Toxin at 0%. Yes! Hold on. Warning. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. Miss the puzzles. <laughs> this should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I don't have to fool to myself. Oh, and I'm, I'm, lo I'm loving this way of a time. This reminds me of Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. This place is huge, and we're only seeing the top layer. It goes down for miles, all sealed off years ago, of course. We should be getting close. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets. She'll never know what hit her. <laughs> hold on, hold on, because I, I, mm, I might not have thought this next part would be good. Ah! Well, uh, I, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Get to her. I'll find you. Yeah, you looked. Was I not supposed to look at the implosion? It specifically says, "Look at the implosion." The instructions on the wall says, "Look at the implosion." <laughs> I don't know why you wouldn't. What happens if you don't look at the implosion? Do you like not get a bonus or something? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I find that guy to be very annoying. The devs are sad. All right, I can't go in there. This was probably not the best move I could have made. Keep unlocked. Oh. I honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. In fact, I devised a much more elaborate trap further ahead for when you got through this easy one. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. 
Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh-huh. Seriously, though. Goodbye. back there. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. Hello? I hate you so much. Morning. Central core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about. To initiate a core transfer, please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Core transfer. Oh, you are kidding me. I've got an idea. Do what it says. Plug me in. Do not plug that little idiot into my mainframe. No, you should plug that little idiot into the mainframe. Don't you? Substitute core accepted. Substitute core, are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Corrupted core, are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Unless a stalemate associate is present to press the stalemate resolution button. Hold me out. Leave me in. Leave me in. Please don't press, don't press it. Don't do it. Yes, do do it. Don't press that button. What? You don't know what you're doing. I think she's lying. Oh, that button. Not so fast. Think about this. You need to be a trained stalemate associate to press that button. You're unqualified. Okay, don't listen to it, boy. It is true. You don't have to point it. It's something far more important. That's right. A finger. All right, with which to press that button so that she won't kill us. Impersonating a stalemate associate. I just act. Oh. Stalemate resolved. Please return to the core transfer bay. Here I go! Wait, what if this hurts? What if this really hurts? Oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just... No, you're not. You are, it is going to hurt, isn't it? Exactly how painful are we to... Ah! battery. It's a toy for children. And now she lives in it. 
<laughs> Sorry, uh, what? excited. I'm excited. I hope you're excited, Nisha. The fall. I love the humor in this game. I love the humor. I would say it's a good puzzle game, but the humor is what makes me want to keep playing. I mean, it, I'd play even if it was no humor, but the humor is top notch. All right, okay. Let's see what we got here. We're definitely at the bottom. I mean, the song at the end of the first game is great. Musical. You missed it, but GLaDOS was stolen by the bird. Uh oh, the bird. That's a long shot. They just sent in draft one of my thesis statement for my thesis. Oh, very cool. What are you studying? If you don't mind me asking. I just have to figure out what I'm shooting at. I could have sworn it was that. I don't know why I'm trying to shoot miles and miles away when I can just shoot. Like that. Okay.
Um, distance learning has affected students in Mandarin. Well, very interesting. That does sound like pretty complex. What is, is your major um, Chinese, Cantonese, Mandarin? Oh, probably Mandarin if you were speaking a, a Mandarin course. I don't know how I even assumed Cantonese at that point. Um, are you a native Mandarin speaker or is it something you learned in addition to um, Is that a language you picked up or is that a language you sp grew up speaking because I think you know I've been learning Mandarin for the past three years Cantonese is much more difficult I grew up um, in a very multicultural area, and so I knew a lot of people who spoke both, but I didn't know one was more difficult than the other. All right, so this is gonna zoom in on something then. Foreign tones, which are inflection to indicate different words with the same sound. Man. Wow, it's insane. I had no idea there was that much complexity between them. Most people don't. Now I forget. I think Mandarin is the one that is more predominant throughout China. Is that correct? Or am I wrong on that too? Because I'm willing to be wrong, right? I mean, I, I don't speak anything like that. Um. Yeah, some of those. This is exactly where I need to be going. Because if I remember what my friends told me when I was growing up, Cantonese is mostly around Canton, whereas Mandarin is more of the more dominant language for the rest of China. Uh, Mandarin is the government language from China. There are many dialects spoken. Yeah. So I have that. Uh, Shanghainese is no tones, only context, I believe. So how did you get into studying Mandarin versus Cantonese and Chinese language as a whole? Shh, let's not, okay, okay. That's the wrong button. Go to um, 
actually have a question. When when you Tim, Tim, I'm kind of at an intricate part of the game. Can you skip to the end and what the actual question is? Um, why do stream elements like have a picture? Like when you tap on it, it's like a flame thing. I don't know. Okay. Okay. All right, Bobby. Yes, no, I knew I was missing the cutscene. Um, I wanted to take German, but I was fluent in Southern German and they taught Northern and they wanted me to start over. Then I decided to take the hardest language I could, which is Mandarin. I fell hard, head over heels with for the language. Ah, my German is terrible. I'm going to be very honest with you. Ich hab Deutsch nicht gut gesprochen. And you can pretty much tell exactly how bad it was by that one sentence. It's okay. You can feel free to judge me. Beautiful. My German or this landscape is beautiful. Because those are two terribly different things. Look around. I am looking around. The little globes. These are pretty nice graphics, I do have to give them that. Alright, so I can put a hole there. just gonna drop me into that. She's saying to look further up on that. Oh, not for a clue, just the aesthetics. It is interesting. It's very interesting. doesn't get any more angles. See what's going on. This will get me further out. So you say you spoke German. Where did you learn German? You kind of wonder what this world looked like before it all collapsed. You know? 
that's what I'm thinking about when I'm looking at this. This was once a very impressive society which has fallen in shatters. What did this look like? How long ago was it? What does that say? Underground train to test shafts. My grandfather speaks German. I learned elementary school and then high school. Very cool. I took it in junior high and high school, and I took it a little bit in college, too. I also tried Duolingo for a bit, but I wasn't feeling it because I had no one to speak German with, right? And when... It's one thing to, like, practice German and listen to German music and watch German movies, but unless you're conversing in it and really thinking about how to have a conversation in it, you're not going to really do anything with it. All right, I'm gonna just try something. So we gotta see what I can do up here. I'm gonna jump through this. So that was up there. And these, to my knowledge, I can't do anything with, right? They, yeah, I can't fall through that and land on anything in particular. So I go through here. The answer is closer than you think. Go back to the one with the train. Maybe like that's a door I can open. That would be that, that would make me feel really stupid that I didn't try to open that door earlier. Nope, that doesn't do anything. This is about. I mean, they painted that wall for that high for a reason. Okay, that. Let's go back through and look at it one more time. Let's see if there's anything I'm missing. Nope. So that maybe I could shoot myself onto that floor. That doesn't do anything. Or maybe I need to shoot onto that. Yeah, that doesn't get me anything. It's closer than you think. Closer than you think. <sighs> I feel like that's where I'm supposed to be. Something on that. I definitely think it's back to that. I think it's that area. And I just need to figure out what I'm going to be shooting my ray gun onto. I said ray gun like it's a ray gun. I 
Alright, let's go back through and look through. is closer than you think. You gotta look beyond that. It's up. I don't want to give too many hints. I appreciate you not wanting to give too many hints. Alright, let's pull back. So I still think that's the right approach. I'm trying to be as vague as possible, still being helpful. Oh, I really appreciate it. You're doing a very good job. Aloha, trying to be as vague as possible. I'm still being helpful. <laughs> All right, let's go back through this one more time. Danger, fall, don't fall in the water. Do not lean on railing. Look up for the aesthetics. Shoot to that corner and see if it changes anything to be in that corner of it. Zoom. There's that door there. Okay. Now if I go through this one. That doesn't get me any more spaces to shoot it onto. It's beyond an obstacle. Yeah, so it's obviously I'm trying to shoot onto something beyond this. So do I need to go lower? see that door. Maybe I don't need to even be going through that. Maybe I can see it from here. Not this one. This next one. It's the one back. It's the one back. Are you? Am I what? Beyond an obstacle? No, I seriously doubt I'm beyond an obstacle. Let's come over here and let's look. Is it even higher do I need to go? Do you need to think high? Dude, I have no clue where I'm shooting at right now. I'm not asking for hints. I'm just, I have no clue. Cause like my gut instinct tells me going here. This is what makes the most sense. 
to get up to that. But I can't figure out how to get in over onto this. This exists. But that's just gonna let me fall into the water. I think you might just be right. I think you are just right the way you are. So, using this is the right thing. I just need to be able to find what I'm shooting at. And you're probably screaming, no, this is not the right thing. I know you. Right, because I feel like I keep walking to that. I'm screaming. Oh, I feel so bad for you right now. Don't feel bad. I'm not feeling too bad. I mean, you're, you're watching the stream. You're... The answer is hidden. Oh, I figured the answer is hidden. If it wasn't hidden, it wouldn't be... Right. I never climbed up anything, so that tells me that there's nothing to climb up there. Alright, let's go back down. Just want to look at every single one of these X ones that come out here. Look toward the bright light. I see that bright light. Your mindset is interesting to you. Really? Fascinating. We have those. There's that bright light, too. There's these bright lights. Is it bright? That. Now let's go look through here one more time. That's the brightest light there is. I mean, they're all roughly the same. Is it? <laughs> this is pretty bright here. Oh, are you kidding me? I didn't want to more heroes, Olympians. You're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Free as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. To science. Okay. Yeah, I do my best to be quiet when they're actually talking. Can't believe that one took me as long as that did. I really feel embarrassed about it. Not too bad.
Don't feel embarrassed. All right. <sighs> I need to jump through there. I know what I need to do. I need to go boom. Let's get that back up there. so rough. I can't believe I missed my jump. Alright, let's walk out here. Now at least I'm going to be standing over the right jumping spot. No. <laughs> that was a satisfying splat. Enter. Ooh. This is amazing. Spirit of Idaho National Potato Board for the promotion of potato science. Cave Johnson Shower Curtain Salesman of the Year. Oh wait. Primer Defense Contractor of the Year runner up. Very cool. And there it is. Ah, uh, I missed the grid ashtrays like that. Now we can come up here, we can press this. Still can't believe I didn't think about that, looking through that. I'm glad it's just me, you and Nisha, and that you're not embarrassed for me and you're here telling me about how smart you are, learning like 85 different languages, Cantonese, Mandarin, Tongue along, high German, low German. Mm -hmm. I'm just glad you're here. Aw, thank you. This bot is hysterical. I worked hard on that bot. All right, that will take me all the way back down to the bottom, I think. Which is probably not where I want to go. Instead, I probably want to go right there. All right. Uh, I'm gonna be right back. So Nisha, you are about to see something that no one has gotten to see before on my chat. And this is just, I'm very excited for you. Um, I'm worried about DMCA, like rightly, everyone else is rightly worried about DMCA here. So I had my, I had a, a song that I was using as a be right back screen and I, I felt I needed something that 
no one in their right mind would think is DMCAable. So, I'll be right back. Dad will be right back. Dad will be right back. He might use the bathroom. He might get a snack. <laughs> he might move Audrey. He might move Sam to his bedroom. He might move Maggie. He might go to get a snack or a drink in five minutes. He might be right back in one minute or two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes, eight minutes, nine minutes, ten minutes, or uh, an hour. If you see a streamer's name pop up in the chat, he might come to rate someone. He and might just come to go home. He might just come to go in the bathroom also. And please don't <laughs> say he needs to go poop. <laughs> and he was ready for the finale. And the other chap. He's going to be right back. He's, He's going to be right back. Dad will be right back. Dad will be right back. He might use the bathroom. He might get a snack. <laughs> he might move Audrey. He might move Sam to his bedroom. <laughs> he might move Maggie. He might go to get a snack or a drink in five minutes. He might be right back in one minute or two minutes. Three minutes, four minutes, five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes, eight minutes, nine minutes, ten minutes, or uh, an hour. If you see a streamer's name pop up in the chat, he might come to rate someone. He and might that... just come to go home. He might just come to go in the bathroom also. And please don't say he needs to go poop. <laughs> and he was ready for the grand finale. And the other chap. He's gonna be right back. He's, He's gonna, gonna be, be right back. Dad. I'm, I hope you enjoyed that. That was the world premiere. My kids had so much fun making that. They've been dying to show that. So. I hope it was everything that you wanted it to be. <laughs> Let's get back to Portal. <laughs> oh, I gotta go up, I think. They worked so hard on that, I was so proud of them. That was like all their, like, I kind of told them what I was going for, and they just kind of did it themselves. That doesn't do me any good. Except I just realized what I needed to do. Yep, I'm gonna have to make that jump somehow. My dad's ringing over here since my middle sister singing. This really brought the feelings for me. Oh, I'm so glad that did. Now I need to figure where I need to jump into so I can be catapulted across over there. Because it has to be something where I can drop like a super, super high distance. I mean, that is a super high distance, but I don't think that's going to get me into anything that I can drop into. Yeah, 
Yeah, a super high distance. I'm up really high on something, but I don't think that that ground is jump upable. Or is it? Nah, I think that's just gonna take me all the way back down. Just go back up to the top, and we're gonna throw ourselves off of it to our death, and then it will return us to where we started from anyway. Just go all the way back to the top. Yeah, because the further it is, it's it's gonna fling me to the end. Nothing. Nope. Oh, elevator. That is good to know. Elevator. It's alright, we got this. See, it took me a second, but I figured it out. So yeah, I just gotta go down one flight on the escalator. And then I can, this will be above me because I'll be one flight down. I'll jump straight down into it. I'll get catapulted across the thing. We're, we're getting there. We're working our way through this. I'm so glad you're here tonight, Nisha. I'm just gonna be honest with you. This is really has sparked a lot of joy for me. This has been a lot of fun. I've gotten to know you a little better. I mean, I see you all the time in Chantella's chat. This has been a lot of fun. I feel like I've gotten to know you more. And now, like, when I see you in one of the chats, I'm going to be like, oh my god, Nisha! All right. Yeah, oh my god, I crawl, exactly. Nailed it. I know, I know that. See, I can I can make jumps like that once I figure out where I'm jumping from. I hope I was supposed to do that. I just randomly went and did that. Passcode entrance. I hope I'm supposed to do that. That's, you know, I'm a dad. I'm just gonna press a button and hope for the best sometimes. Alright, let's go down since going up did nothing for me. Gel flow. Nothing down there. I can't undo that. Oh. I keep not thinking about that I have a gun and I can shoot holes through walls. You live in the mass area, where do you do? Um, so I work for a data infrastructure. Um, I work for a health insurance company in the fraud department. I do data infrastructure. So I like build. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. 
At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Um, I build data infrastructure for the fraud investigators to make decisions on how to investigate people. Um, and I live in Western Mass, so um, I don't live in Springfield, but if you know where Springfield, Massachusetts is, I live in a town that is immediately around Springfield. So, yeah, with all the insurance companies that near Hartford, it's a pretty good guess that I am in the Springfield to Hartford metropolitan area. Unless you didn't know that. Right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. I feel like we did this gel in the last game, too. Repulsion gel. Sweet, sweeter, slightly less non-toxic form of fiberglass insulation causes subcontinent food items to bounce off the lining of the diner's descended its stomach and its mouth. For various reasons, the product was pulled from the shells. Average first attempt to create a dietic pudding substitute. Okay. Okay. Aloha, Syphilis. Welcome to the chat, Syphilis. Let me do some introductions. We have Syphilis and we have Nisha on the chat. Uh, Syphilis is a friend of mine who I recently met. She is from the Caribbean. Um, Guyana, if I'm right. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Um, she uh, is just a pretty awesome, I believe she's a grad student also. Um, but she's studying psychology and also Trinidad and Tobago. How close is that to Guyana? Please let me know how close that is. I would really want to know how close they are in terms of geographical location. Um, and Nisha is a grad student as well. Um, I don't, she is studying, her thesis is in, uh, Mandarin. It's right above Venezuela. How close is Venezuela to Guyana though? Big brain time. Mandarin. Look at this. You guys don't even need me now. You guys can chat. Okay. So this, I need something to be here. I feel really bad that the bot isn't got its proper name of Aloha the bot because you're enjoying it so much, Nisha. But yes, and Syphilis is not a gr uh, Nisha is not a grad student, but you just turned in a thesis. So what does that make you, if not a grad student? Okay, there's nothing down there. I can shoot that wall. So what we can shoot on to. Because that's to my death. You can believe yourself and be a grad student. That's true. You can believe in yourself and be a grad student. All right. There it goes. 
da 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 they do, they make students do an un thesis as undergrads these days? Damn. I really went to college at the right time. We didn't have to do crap like that. It sucks. All right, so you're undergrad. Okay. Um. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. Oh. There we go. I'm gonna look a bit, bro. Have a good one. Hey, thanks so much for popping in here, by the way. Wait a minute. Someone, someone got the joke out of the way. Speaking of dinner, I gotta make assignments to do, so I'm gonna make dinner. Do you like that that the dad joke? I don't have a good night at stream up. Hell in the message for... Oh, I gotta allow. Hold on, hold on. I gotta allow. Allow. I permitted the term. Syphilis. Yes, you like the dad joke. Yeah, no. I've, I've, I've approved the term. Hopefully the term will not get banned again. All right, what do we got here? Okay. Let me hold on one second. Hey, what's up? Sure. I will be putting up the Be Right Back screen again. Syphilis, if you're still around, you're about to see some good, good high quality entertainment right here. Dad will be right back. Dad will be right back. He might use the bathroom. He might get a snack. <laughs> he might move Audrey. He might move Sam to his bedroom. <laughs> he might move Maggie. He might go to get a snack or a drink in five minutes. He might be right back in one minute or two minutes, three minutes. Four minutes. Five minutes. Six minutes. Seven minutes. Eight minutes. Nine minutes. Ten minutes. Or uh, an hour. If you see a streamer's name pop up in the chat, he might come to rate someone. He and might that... just come to go home. He might just come to go in the bathroom also. And please don't say you need to go pool. <laughs> and it was ready for the grand finale. And he's gonna be right back. He's, he's gonna, gonna be, be right back. back. Dad will be right back. Dad will be right back. He might use the bathroom. He might get a snack. <laughs> he might move Audrey. He might move Sam to his bedroom. He might move Maggie. He might go to get a snack or a drink in five minutes. He might be right back in one minute. I'm back. I'm not sure if anyone was really watching. I, I know Nisha is still here, but you know, I know she's seen it already. And that was not a, I love you, honey, please come talk to me. That was more of a, 
I am texting you and for some reason your iPad is vibrating. Please come move it because it's keeping me awake. That is modern love right there. All right. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Gotta bounce on some stuff. All right, so that just triggered something back in this room. Up to there, okay. jump as far as we can. No, I did not jump. Made it. Um, I am ready. Got some tea and got in your jammies. Oh, excellent. Good jobs. Good to get in your jammies. Covered in that repulsion gel. Here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this. It's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Listen to the music when you jump. It reminds me of the music from um, 28 Days Later. When they're like in happiness and they're like driving and like they think the world is not right and they're going to drive to the town and it's just kind of happy music. That's what it reminds me of. Musically. What type of tea are you drinking tonight, Nish? Alright, here we go. Here we go, yo. All these science fears are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. <laughs> Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. Alright. There's not a whole lot I can do over here. Probably just need to climb across this wreckage. There you go. That works. Jump chai. All right. going from here. Cool, 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 cool. That's obviously where I want to go. I'm going to throw that out there. I think I got this. Yeah, no, I think I got this. I just need to figure out where I'm going to go up. Oh. Okay. 
Okay. Let's see what we got over here. That doesn't get me anywhere closer to anything. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. Okay, so let's go there. Okay, that's not gonna work. Okay, okay, let's go back through here. Alright, let's go back through here. Let's try something new. Okay. Got this. Yeah, I have, I have confidence in myself. I have confidence. Not so much confidence anymore. Okay. Let's think. Think it through, think it through. I need to be able to get up to that. Yep. Use a portal. Thank you, Mootsaboot. Aloha, Mootsaboot. For those who do not know Mootsaboot, uh, let me do some introductions. We have Nisha. Nisha is a college student and she is Thundering Madarin. Just recently turned in her thesis. Mootsaboot is a variety streamer from Canada. Also does fitness streams and does uh, other great games. You both are awesome people. I thoroughly enjoy it. And if Syphilis is still in the chat lurking, um, awesome, another awesome person out there. Uh, I don't really do know what Syphilis does other than it's just a totally cool dude who calls me bro. Although she's a do that. All right. That's not the right approach. I'm not getting high enough off of that. Let's try shooting it onto this. Right.
Okay. Now that doesn't get me through to that, but that can get me, I think. I don't want to do that. I know I want to. Nope. Nope. I'm pretty sure there's a pill for syphilis. Yes, no, I'm pretty sure there's a pill for syphilis too. Alright. Let's get back to me. So now I get... I need to get there. And I need to get Yep, that isn't nearly far enough of a jump. But Oh, and to make matters worse, that gets rid of my portal when I go through that blue. Alright. So if I go through that, it's going to kill my thing. Alright, so let's go back. The positive side, I can go around this way. I just need to figure out what I can jump down to. I don't like that jump. Right? Because I'm going to jump down to something and it's going to fire me through that. Yeah, see, that isn't something I can shoot into. Let's just see what happens. Ah ha ha ha! So what I need to do is actually come back. High five, wall with face. Yes, no, no, I know what I'm supposed to be doing. Let's go back to that, because that's going to reset it. So I got my thing there. And then it is just a matter of... No! Just a heads up, that 
vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. All right, Nisa, I just got to know. Be honest with me. How much longer do I got? 20 minutes? Four more hours? Just have an, I want to have an idea if I should be calling you tonight and just doing this next Sunday. Four-ish hours. Okay. So, I want to thank everyone participating tonight. Niche is kicking it. Give or take two extra hours. Niche has been very nice in helping me figure out how much longer we have in this bad boy. Um, and I can't give another four hours despite the fact that... Um, hold on. Yeah, it is late. Um, so yeah, uh, kids need sleep and all that stuff. So let's find someone to raid, shall we? Who do we have? You drink caffeine, yes. Um, let's go to Jenna Gamerson. I don't know where I know her. But I've hung out with her a couple times. She seems pretty dope. So let's get over there. She's playing Mario Kart 8. She seems pretty laid back and pretty awesome. So I recommend her. Save game. Alright, so that's my... Uh, new escape save. Save. Um, so let's go raid her. When you get there, just say Aloha. That's all you gotta do. She'll know who it is. Alright. So thank you so much everyone for being here. This was a lot of fun tonight. Shit, it's huge!